Hello and welcome back to my channel. In this video you can watch me taking a 17 hour night train ride from Almaty to Turkestan. I had the best company and also learned some Kazakh words while enjoying the fantastic view. There was so much to experience that in the end the train ride felt only like one hour. For me it wasn't only a means of transportation but also a core memory. I love being at main stations. That gives me the feeling of a new adventure is waiting for me. I spent quite a long time in Almaty because I needed to edit and organize my trip. So I couldn't wait to finally leave town even though I liked it. But I wanted to see something new. I'm about to hop on the train that brings me to Turkestan. It's a night train. I think it takes 17 hours. And now it's almost 10. Um, I brought so much food just to make sure I won't starve. <laughs> I'm very excited because I freaking love night accommodation and like uh, trains, buses, ferries or whatever. Uh, it's so exciting always to see how it's organized. It's a thing for me, I don't know why I'm so excited. And I always choose the lowest class for extra experience. I booked my tickets online through the website tickets.kz and I paid only 6,000 tenge or 12 euros. You can choose between first, second and third class, but be aware the train is pretty popular. So if you're on a tight schedule, I would recommend you to book a few days in advance. I don't know why it's so dark here. I will put my bag in this coffee. Here is my accommodation for tonight. I have bed 14 with a view <laughs> yeah it's cozy <laughs> with me on the train was it's another so fellow cool. backpacker a girl from japan i, have, I think i have to jump <laughs> <laughs> no it makes sense to step here oh okay <laughs> <laughs> and we are moving I just received my linen. By the way, please do not confuse Turkestan with Turkmenistan, the country. Turkestan is a city in the south of Kazakhstan. <laughs> I was wondering why do I have two mattresses? I thought it would be very soft for me tonight. <laughs> it was the mattress of the other day. <laughs> I'm still young, but how do old people get up here? Please tell me. transportation because it's so efficient you can sleep it's mostly cheap also and you save uh, accommodation on a hostel or whatever at the same time and most importantly you cover distance so the next day you wake up in a completely different place The biggest hazard on this train ride is to accidentally bang your head on the feet sticking out into the aisle. <laughs> Time to sleep. Good nighty. And good morning. This was at 6 a.m. I slept very well through the night. Like a baby in a cradle. <laughs> the toilet gets 3 out of 10 from me, but only because they had soap and toilet paper provided. Tell me when you're ready I'll get away, he's waiting I learned to love the look And I can read your signs We're jumping on the first bus Don't need no one to save us We're pulling up the curtains It covers this blue sky 
This train goes all the way from Almaty to Mangashlak at the very left end of Kazakhstan. That makes in total 3269 kilometers. And if you choose this route, you will live in the train for three days. Baklashanov. Is it Baklashanov? It says Baklashanov, right? Uh -huh. <laughs> um, tomato and uh, uh, eggplant. <laughs> Every time the train makes a stop, you have local women selling local products like cord. Kurt is like a dried cheese made from fermented milk and the people here in Kazakhstan just love it. You can basically find it everywhere. I chose ice cream for one dollar instead. While I ate my ice cream, I learned some words from the Kazakh woman next to me. We talked for a while and I asked her if she wants to take a picture with me. Yeah, I don't mind. I travel around the world a long time. Three years. Uh, so some yeah. Uh, yeah. So no husband. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So no husband. Yeah. 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 I went to uh, Thailand, Vietnam, Cambodia. Indonesia? Indonesia, yeah. Uh, in India. Yeah, I went there. Uh, we are here for a quick stop to get some lunch and people are selling a lot of watermelon and honeydew melons and you can get fried rice you can get fried fish yeah it's good to finally stand upright and not just lay down it's really yeah it hurts your back after a while the train is so long look at that
say goodbye. <laughs> Auntie was so sweet. What a wonderful lady. She gave me so much love in this short period of time. It's strange to say that, but it really feels like she's part of my family. <laughs> That was it, 17 hours of train ride. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did because for me it was a real adventure. And if you want, subscribe to my channel and give me a thumb up. In the next video, I'll show you Turkestan.